What's up everybody, Gundam Flexing here. Hope y'all's week has been going so far so good. So this is War Tech Fighters, otherwise known as WTF, full release on Steam. I've dumped about 30 hours into this game uh, to include, I mean I've been playing it for almost, uh, almost a year already since I had the pre-release and I also had the Black Sails update and everything. This is my War Tech, it is the Fury. And I pull up the stats here on the right side, top right where my mouse is at. I do 1140 damage in terms of my heavy and my missiles do 501. My damage is so high, I pretty much can melt anything in one shot. The downside is my health is low and so is my armor. Uh, so I could get melted pretty quickly uh, if I go against waves and waves and waves of the enemy. Uh, so what happened in the previous video till now is that I kept grinding on levels because I didn't know when the level specifically or when the campaign would specifically end. And funny enough, I kept grinding and grinding so I could uh, spend more money in my research here uh, that I eventually beat the campaign. So if I go to missions, it'll tell me that the mission set is complete uh, or it won't even bring it up. But um, if you do it, you bring up missions, it'll tell you that it's complete and the only way is to go through the simulator. So I think a proper ending for this uh, War Tech Fighter series is to play the replay, play the very last level, to let you guys see what it's all about. Now, if you read my comments in the YouTube channel, or excuse me, in my YouTube videos uh, in regards to War Tech Fighters, and if you just watch the videos in general, uh, you'll notice that I get melted very, very easily. I mean, there are some levels where I just have to kite my way for ridiculous amount of times. I think I kited one ship for like 15 minutes because he was doing so much damage to me even with my uh, even with my shields up he was just melting me away and I died so often. So up to the final mission I decided to change my uh, difficult settings to uh, easy instead of normal and it makes a world of difference. So this is going to be the last level. It will be a simulated level. I'm not going to get any money from it, just straight XP. I'm currently level 35, and by leveling up you get more health. And I think this would be a proper way to send off this series. So, without farther ado, here we go, and hopefully my mic settings is good to go this time. If not, you can't hear my beautiful voice, you'll just watch and enjoy the video of me just holding right click, like my life depended on it. Because, again, 1,100 plus damage, crush anything. Alright, here we go. This is the planet Ragnarok. We're going to skip. This mission is set ahead. And every time you're in the simulator, this whole thing is blue. Pretty much, you, oh, no, pretty much you hold the entire environment. You want to execute. And again, this is just a tip. You always want to execute your enemies. Save yourself some energy. Oh, they melt so fast. Oh, come on. They melt so fast. Uh oh. Uh oh, Hell Hydra. Oh no, energy levels are skyrocketing. Oh lord. Next mission set ahead. Alright, here we go. Getting closer. Alright, execute, execute, baby. Oh, so annoying. Execute. Oh, goodness. And again, dude, I, I, I crush my energy levels so ridiculously much. So ridiculous. So I'm doing so much damage, they just melt away. I don't. Oh, here we go. Here's an execution. There you go. Get my energy back. Oh, oh, so much is going on. Shields up, baby. Execute. Oh, this one can't execute, unfortunately. I can try to execute. Oh, can't execute that one. All right, this guy's gonna have to open his mouth towards me, and there you go. This is easy money, guys. There we are. To do this ship, you also have to kite, so you go in range of your weapons, and then you can back away. Because as soon as you back away, the uh, ship can't target you, so it's a it's a very cheap way to win. But if you stay too close, 
the weapons in the center of the ship will just absolutely crush you. Uh oh, let's go to this side. Remember, C is to tell your allies to do attack. Alright, here's one. There's two back here. We're gonna melt that away. And that should be it. Here we go. Yeah, I'm the man. Yep, we're gonna skip through all this dialogue. I wasn't really too into the campaign. There was a lot going on. Uh, it's a little bit disjointed, but I, uh, I don't really play the game for the campaign. Most games I don't play for the campaign. Unless if it's something like RPG or JRPG. But up here, you can tell that something is up because they left the uh, they left on the map a lot of uh, health health barrels, so you know things are going to go down. Right now. Things are going to go down, boys. All right, same thing over here. Engage the enemy ship. Engage the enemy ship. All right, here we go. Just know all his stuff. There you go. Uh oh, I'm on health. I will fly away. <laughs> I'm so fast that other ships can't catch up to me. Isn't that crazy? Plus, I have my allies I do some of my dirty work. I just kind of execute them. Oh lord, I died! Alright, so I wasn't paying attention to my bad guys. And yes, this is set on easy. Uh, and when it's set on easy, the number of enemies doesn't decrease, but I think the amount of damage they do definitely does decrease by a lot because when I played this on normal, they killed me within seconds. Absolute seconds. It's pretty ridiculous. I think you probably have to be like level 50 with at least 80 to maybe 90% of the things uh, already upgraded. And most of my stuff upgraded is my attack and my uh, special. I was also informed that you could shoot your Kamehameha. So I'm gonna try that. See what it looks like, guys. Alright. Oh, okay, I guess I can't shoot it. Well, whatever, it was a nice step. Alright, here we go. Alright, let's get ready to kite them, so. Get ready to kite them. This is how you beat them. Beat them at their own games, gentlemen. One at a time. Here we go. Can we execute that guy? Execute you! Yeah. Execute, please. Oh, can execute. Alright, let's, uh, let's get rid of this guy. He's a little bit annoying. Oh, wow. That was easy. And that's what I mean by fighting. I want to do the same thing, just go in range and then back out against the turrets. Usually, uh, it's so strong I could just knock out the turrets in one shot. But there's so many of them that if you take a ball, you're going to take a good amount of damage. And that's how you do it, gentlemen. Alright, alright, now we just want to dismantle this ship. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Boom, and that's it. Well, that's it as we're halfway done with the mission. Here we go. Here we go. Everyone fly with me. Pay attention to the map. And we got some enemies coming around. Execute. Excellent. Execute. Dang it. There it is. Just destroy it. Just strip him of his turrets and his toys and he won't do anything to you. Look at that. Now he's running. Sort of sucks. And yes, they left satellites around here for your additional money. Here we go. A third ship. So what the ships are basically doing is that they're trying to power this Omega weapon to shoot it down at the planet. Uh oh, let me take it. Uh oh, I'm frozen. <laughs> uh oh, uh oh, there we go. So you had to just aim the... 
I don't know how your war tech even survives that kind of blast, but apparently I can. And I just reflected the beam back at the ship. Engage the enemy ship and destroy. Engage the enemy ships again, strip him of all his stuff. Execute, dang it. Execute, yeah. Yes. Okay. Ooh, okay, I need to get some distance. Ah. Perfect, just in time. I was losing quite a bit of health. I hate those ships. Oh! Oh, Mr. Mr. Execute! Mr. Execute! Alright, here comes the bigger ship. Oh, no! He almost killed me. Alright, let me get some health. Can you fly to the other side of the map? Does that help? No, it's just a satellite. There's no point in... By the way, if you play simulations, again, you're not going to get anything, uh... You're not going to get uh, any money, you're just going to get experience points. Let me get some more health. That's one right there. Alright, now let's go back and fight this bull. I wonder how fast I'm traveling. Maybe like Mach 3 or something. This is so fast. Here we go. And you just get in range, barely get in range of the uh, turrets. And that's how the. That's how the. Could be troubled, I guess. That's how people would say. Here we go. One more side. Uh oh. I'm trying to put up the last minute resistance. There we go. Slice it. Boom. Boom. that? Oh no. Data collected. There's no pilot inside. She went out for a walk. Maybe she was just tired of what? Oh no, it's the bad guy that we've been chasing for so long, guys. Oh, it is her, the traitor. I don't really remember much of her in the storyline. All we have to know is that she's a traitor and she has to go. Traitors gotta die. Oh, here we go. Warning. Uh oh. Okay, so there's also enemy war techs, but don't worry, look how fast they melt. Boom, alright. That was the only war tech support she had. And now we're going to wait, use our Kamehameha beams, and then unload on her. Okay, so I- oh, oh, oh gosh! Alright, here we go. Ready to come out, may out? I am. Boom. Okay, now everyone just unloads on her. Just, just unload on her. Just absolutely destroy her. Warning. Enemy war Uh-oh, more war techs, and we handle the little minions first. We handle the minions first. Oh no! That's a- okay, I hate this engagement, combat engagement system, but- and uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, W. Hey, I actually have to look at my keyboard. It turns out if you just like hit random directional keys, you're, you're, you're meant to do some fancy moves. Like that, like that. Yeah, like that. That's fancy. It's all fine. That, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, S. That's a fancy sword fight. My fingers are getting so tired. I wish I could just have an option to disengage. Yeah, fancy sword. Okay, here we go. Now we can we can finish him off. There you go. There you go. He's done. Tell my friends to take him on. Ugh. I actually need to execute. All right, now we're going to tell our friends to hand up the last mech. Watch him milk. Uh, let's get some milk. Ah. 
one last, one last minion deck on this side of the map. I don't know what he's doing hanging out over there, but dude is just chilling out. He doesn't even know what's going on. Now here, exchange missiles, exchange volleys. All right, now we can focus our attention on the tree board. I need to get closer. There you go, give my friends the command. The black hound, that's her. The missiles are trying to still chase me down, that's impressive. All right, there we go. Now we just unload. Where's my allies? I have no clue. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, pirates, oh no. Those dirty, dirty pirates. Oh, I gotta get some help. Nope, 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 my way out of this. Almost. Uh oh, okay, I can destroy this one pretty easily. I can execute. Oh my goodness, didn't give me an option. Can I execute this one? Oh, there's too much going on. Let me run away. Oh lord, they do a ton of damage. See what I mean? If I don't turn the difficulty on, they will just mess me up until the next week, man. Let me quickly strip this ship. Ah, oh, let me execute, execute. Oh, you guys die way too fast. All right, now we can focus our attention on the last one. All my allies are trying to hit it, and they're not trying to figure it out, but the shield, her shield is just too strong. Right, here we go, come on me out time, baby. There we go, there we go, where did she go? Come on, everyone, just unload on her. Uh-oh, I did not, I did not engage this. So, uh, yeah, she doesn't even have the health bar on top, my god. But yeah, she can't beat my spam, okay? She just can't beat my spam button on the, uh, the basket. See? Oh my goodness! Yes! Yes! You can't beat this, I have to switch my hands. Oh, no, you can probably hear the clicking through the uh, mic. Because my mouse is so close to the mic. Now my left hand is getting super tired. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Oh! Oh, Lord! She's retaliating. Maybe she's just clicking faster than me, but I doubt it. I doubt it though. Oh god. One of these. A. Alright. No one freak out. I don't think I can lose. Oh no. Oh no, maybe. Yeah, I did not engage this fight. I, I'm not a really big fan of uh, uh my, my slow attack is just too slow for my heavy attack. Oh my god, she's just hitting me up with all these combos. Oh my god, here we go again, D. Yeah, guys, so this is it. I have no idea how much health she has. It looks like she has a ton left. Yes. Oh my god, my hands are getting tired. Alright, here we go. Oh my god, how is she winning this? I crushed her last time. Oh my god, D. Yeah, last time, I remember I just straight up engaged her in a dog fight. I didn't really have to uh, do this. You gotta remember guys, I have not upgraded my uh, my sword fighting at all whatsoever. I think it's a useless skill. So the simulation failed, will it take me back to the checkpoint or will they make me redo the whole thing? That's a question that we will have to see. Still loading. Oh my god, they still take me to this. Jesus Christ. Alright guys, I'm sorry. This may be the, where I end the video. Because uh, I couldn't beat her with full health. I don't think I could beat her again with full health. Oh my goodness. I'm just gonna hit my 
Look at my allies, they're just staring. Like, like this is honorable or something. W. Oh goodness. Ugh. Take that. Take. Take that. Take that, oh my god. Ugh. I think she's like learning my movement patterns or something. Oh lord, D. Yeah, yeah, take that, ugly mech. Take my spam, my... <laughs> Guys, my hands are so tired right now. My hands are so tired. My hands are so tired. My right arm is gonna be huge. My right arm's going to be huge, guys. Take that. Take my thrusters. Take my giant thrust. Ugh. Oh, Lord. I'm blocking like a boss. Take this. Oh, my God. My arms, guys. My right arm can't take much more. Oh, Lord be praised. I'm going to kill her. Jesus. Your shield won't hide you from the... Where are my allies? Oh, here we go. Yes, betraying the colony was the worst mistake you could make. Ah. Uh-oh, everyone's going to talk about how we're, how we're going to punish him. Ah. Nice. I like it. Uh oh, we gotta stop the explosion, guys. 57 seconds, here we go. We gotta skip through all this, all this debris. Oh god. Oh lord. So yeah, I I've actually nailed this level on my very first try. I didn't die at all. I'm um, not gonna lie, guys. My my right arm is super sore now. Just let me go fly above. Oh no. Okay, okay. Let's just fly above. Fly above the weapons. Way above. Way, way above. There you go. There you go. You ain't got nothing to say about that, do they? Got 37 seconds. Can I do it again? Can I save the colonies? Can I do it? Can I save the colonies? Oh, I guess I did. Ha 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 ha! Oh, guys, the droids want to sacrifice. So basically, the droids want to sacrifice himself by staying behind. The droid that we really have no emotional connection to. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the end of the first, well, end of, end of the last level. And that's how it ends. You brought peace to the colonies, the levels, hey, I leveled up, nice. And, uh, yeah. That is it. But you also have a bunch of other stuff like challenges and survival. If you could play survival, this is me over here, 1440. And... That's it guys, if you have any questions about this game, you can find it on Steam for $15. I'm pretty sure once Steam also has a sales, you can probably get it for even cheaper. This concludes this series. Y'all, hope you all enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed playing it. Appreciate you all for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video game I choose to play. Peace out.